I don't know if this sequence turned out any good, but I really hope it did. If you are here and watching this video, then you've already seen it, but we've not finished shooting it. But that is what I'm gonna show you in this video. So recently me and Edwin did a commercial shoot for a company that's called Nestlé and they were super kind to allow us to bring the behind the scenes camera so that we can record the entire thing and use the footage to post here on YouTube to show you how we oh, went about to shoot this commercial shoot. And there's a lot of things that we did before the shoot such as writing down a shot list, planning, thinking about the different locations and trying to come up with the concept of making the flakes look as good as possible as at the same time trying to incorporate some hardcore workouts. And I'm not gonna talk as much as you usually do in my videos, but I think that you're gonna enjoy it anyways. But if you wanna go more in depth on how to like actually plan your videos, think about the composition, framing, and those different things, do sign up for the filmmaking course that I will drop in 2021 down below. Let's go. Jag vill att du är fram och så lutar du dig in med ena armen som du ska... Men du tar inte liksom, utan du bara fram och så lutar du in så kickar du det. Någonting snyggt. Du står där. Så blir det. Så att du liksom nästan... Du kanske har greppet blir det snabbt. Så... Det tror jag kommer bli riktigt snyggt. Up and jump, stand on the counter, and get the shot. So we're thinking that this shot is gonna be like straight from up above and the flakes falling into the bowl. Hopefully we're gonna get this shot uh, without doing too many retakes because it's gonna be like, the, the tough part is that I'm shooting this with 24 millimeters. So I'm thinking maybe we're gonna have to jump up to the 40 millimeter to be able to get this shot and have it look the way we want it to. And this time we're also shooting at a higher aperture. So we're gonna shoot around three to four, somewhere around there to get a little bit more of the flakes in focus. It's gonna look good. Perfecto. Så jag brukar säga att det är min sambo. Resting bitch face. Ja, det är också speciellt jag. Ja, men det är bra. Och blunda. Och upp. Det där är ju snyggt. Uh, we're gonna try to get the last shot with the gimbal since we wanna, we wanna make sure that the hero shot is extremely like smooth, steady. There's not gonna be too many movements in this. The best thing would be if we had a slider. But we're gonna use the DJI Ronin SC2 to nail this shot. Pan slightly backwards. Uh, the series are going to be in focus together with the bowl, and that's going to be our hero shot. Ta da! Bam! Ending. What do you think, Edwin? I think it looks really good. It looks, it looks crisp. Yeah. This is like on par with the Campari video. Yeah.
Go. Snyggt. Kör vi igen. 3, 2, 1. Go. Kör vi igen. 3, 2, 1. Go. Bra. Vi har några där. Jag behövde mer close-up på min bicep. <laughs> Oj, det är för <laughs> So I really hope that you enjoyed this video and if you did, please do give it a thumbs up because that would be highly appreciated. And if you haven't subscribed, please do that right here because I would love to see you in the next video. And uh, oh, if you haven't signed up for the course and you're interested, link is still down in uh, the description. Va? Peter from Sweden is saying, here is the final result. One more time.